Hey, Mama Q's babies, how are we doing today? So, today for lunch, breakfast for me, breakfast lunch, because I first time I'm eating today, is Mr. Heroes. It's one thing I missed about the old town we didn't have in Shy. I didn't see any. If there is any, give me a correction, but I didn't see any, uh, was Mr. Heroes. So, I'm hungry. Let me pray, and we'll dig in. It's a chicken filly. Um... It's tenant sub, chicken filly, tenant sub. Okay. Make sure I got my sound on. Sorry about that, guys. Thank you, Lord, for this meal. But it nourish our body is always possible. Bless the hand prepared the meal. Bless the mouth that will receive it. In Jesus' name, amen. So I just got a crush orange pop. And it was a combo um, vinegar. Y'all put vinegar? This is like a childhood nostalgic thing is the vinegar on my sandwich and fries it used to be this place called the great steak in rolling acres mall and they had the best steak sandwiches and i'm gonna be honest i haven't had a steak sandwich that tops theirs since since they closed nobody has come close to the great steak company it was just something about them Philly cheesesteaks. Man, oh man. Oh no. Mm -mm, I almost dropped that. Okay, let me get myself right. Got my Heinz ketchup. Y'all know, ain't promoting, but I just like that ketchup. One second. Oh, right. Yes. Don't that look good? These waffle pies are the best. Mm -mm -mm. So I'm going this Tuesday. I'm going to Taco Tuesday, but we eat tacos any day of the week. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. about that vinegar. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. I'm hungry, y'all. I'm sorry. I have a towel stuck to my fingers. Oh, so good. Feeling came out my sandwich. Mm -mm -mm. Got me had a vinegar. And my messy, messy, messy Marvina. Look at that. Oh, 
It's dripping. Look at that. Mmm. Look at that. Mmm. I'm sharing. Mm. 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 No, this is so good. <laughs> or oh, I'm so hungry. Mm. Mm -mm -mm. Oh, that's my tomato. They ain't tucked all the way through. Oh, this was so good. Now, y'all know I don't like them. Mm -mm -mm. Hold on. I'm not getting full. I don't do a lot of challenges because I don't eat a lot at one time. <laughs> and I'm already a thick madam. I don't need to get too far off my beaten path. So, mm. straw. Excuse me. Let me show y'all this a little closer. Look at that. Mm -mm -mm, that hit the spot. That is delicious, y'all. That's the chicken Philly from Mr. Heroes. Mm -mm -mm. They, they did this one pretty good. Hmm. Can I start on this one? Mm. 
Oh, what's going on? I've been watching. I've been binge watching. Tell y'all what's good. And it's an older TV show. Um, the early 2000s by Tyler Perry. Um, for better or for worse with Marcus and Angela. Excuse me. Classic. Funny. I forgot how funny that show was. It did six seasons from what I've seen. Y'all got to watch it. I recommend y'all go back and watch it. I started from the beginning and worked my way back up. I'm almost done. You can see the, the, the TV glitches and stuff. Oh, the sun must have shined. Look how bright I got. So I'm like, I look angelic. And God said, let there be light. Thank you, Lord, for the light. I don't know. The sun must have just shined on me. Hey, maybe that's a blessing coming. God is covering me. Hey, thank you. Okay, don't get me to show. I feel that. Anyway, so you can see the glitches in, in little cheesy parts. But for the most part, it's good. I love it. I laugh. I'll be sitting there cracking up. Uh, it's really funny. I love them. I wish they would kept it going. Um, so I continue to see it's just amazing. Maybe he'll come back with more of it. And I think then I'm gonna go to Love Thy Neighbor. That's another one. That's like, mm hmm. Um, I'm watching TV show. I mean, I don't watch all the good times. I don't watch all the uh, Sanford and Son and stuff. But that's um, watch for better or for worse. It's funny. It is funny. Yes, it is. And, um, what else? Oh, they're supposed to be coming out with another Wednesday. From Wednesday Adams. Now, the buzz I heard, and don't go quote me, is that they talking about making her a part of the community, uh, L L G T W S. You them. I'm starting to have issues with this, and mind you, I don't have an issue with people that are gay. So don't go lying. If that's what you choose to do in your life, that's what you choose to do. I don't have a heaven or hell to put you in. I don't have but what I don't like is when we start putting this off on our children I have to start monitoring like I've been monitoring but really monitoring even cartoons why can't we let kids keep their innocence because she's supposed to be a teenager a child why can't we let them keep their innocence and why are we allowing uh for the this to go down where you see kids kissing each other on TV. It don't matter if they do it in high school or not. It's a secret. It's who goes and tells their mom that I'm kissing a boy or their dad uh, that uh, I'm kissing. Uh, they, that's their first little kissy little private moment. Why are you showing it? I used to watch the soap operas and when they get ready to get hot and bothered, they would cut, cut it off back in the day. Because of children uh, and families. Why, why show that? Regardless of what we know, you don't have to show it though. And I just don't like that. I, I think it takes away from who her character really, really was. You know, um, and he is, I should say. Um, so we just have to be careful. And... Um, you know, just showing children too much. And that's the problem now. These kids are exposed to too much. I don't care who don't like it. That's why I'm Mama Q. In this page, I'm going to give you the truth and the real. You expose, we expose uh, people, society as a whole, expose children to too much. Now, I try my best not to. I try to monitor, you know, and stuff. And, and even in that, they still get away with doing stuff. Don't get it twisted. It ain't like it ain't at my front door because it is. 
and I sweep at my door before I try to sweep at anybody else's. I'm going to sweep at mine first, so I'm working on my door. So this is for me, too. But you have to monitor this because it's getting out of control. You know, who you lay with, that's your business. But when we start putting the children in it, that's when we have, that's when I get a problem because you're taken away from their innocence. Let them decide. Let them choose. Not putting these subliminal messages in everything. Parents be a parent. I've said it once and I've said it before. Be a parent. Kids don't get here be because the same sex dealing with each other, laying up with each other. Kids get here because the opposite sex come together and make a baby. Unless you do it in a Petri dish. So that's science, not church. But then church is a part of it too, or God. Not church, God is a part of it. Everybody, we go, oh, you're always talking. No, science says male and female makes a human. If all of us were gay, we wouldn't reproduce. Hmm. Think about it. So no matter how you get your child, you still had to have the opposite sex to make the child. And we need to let children be children and make decisions for themselves. So I really hope that they already did it with the one, the Chucky Dow series. And they had the two little boys and they were in grammar school liking each other. This is craziness. You don't got to show all this stuff to these kids. Kids are very smart. So, you know, anyway, you ain't got to like me. I don't have nothing against who you sleep with or what you do in your home. That's your business. But we need to be careful about exposing our children. They don't need to know everything. Such thing as grown folk business. We need to get back to grown folks having grown folk business. Mm -hmm. This was so good. Mm -mm -mm. Mm -mm 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 -mm. Well, I can like that. Like a couple extra thumbs up on some of my videos. We need them thumbs up. Like, 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 like. Make sure you like in the channel. If you're new to my page, mm, mm, mm. Mm. welcome. Welcome. I'm a cute love to everybody. All of y'all. Um, if you haven't subscribed, please subscribe so you'll be notified anytime I post a video or go live and click the notification bell right next to subscribe. Right and all. A-L-L. Then you'll see everything. Comment. Comment below. Because I read them. I respond. You know. So, yeah. And if I try to do um, as quickly as possible. If I see it, I get to it. If not, I will eventually. Um, but comment. Give me some ideas. What y'all what y'all looking for? Do y'all eat while I'm eating? Because you should. Cause I know this make you hungry. And I watch 
the other content creators, I'll get me something to eat because it'll make you hungry. Even if you already ate, you still be like, ooh, that look good. You know, or I do eat before, make sure I'm full because then I don't have the cravings. Because watching some of these uh, content creators and the stuff they be eating be so good. And a lot of them have a lot of the uh, bells and whistles in the editing system. I'm still learning how to do all that. So mine's is not as advanced. And so it really makes their stuff stand out. But as long as you can see it. Mmm. Mm -mm -mm. I'm still transitioning back to your phone. There's some stuff that's not here that controls light. I don't know. the camera, the microphone. So, let's use what I got. Hmm? Um, yeah, thanks for watching. Thanks for having breakfast, brunch, lunch with me. Um, and that's all I have for today. Remember, though, as I always say, when life throws you lemons, you make lemonade. And that's what I do every day. And what that means is, no matter what your trials, no matter what tribulations or whatever you go through you can make it you can push through it you know and even in our situation just know somebody else is going through something way worse than you your situation can be it may seem like it's so bad because i get that i get those thoughts in my head too i say ain't nothing but the devil i'll be sitting there and like oh my god you know it's this it's that you know i'm the only one going through this or however but I get out that funk. You got to speak life into yourself. Don't say I can't. Say I can. Don't say I won't. I will. This is not the end for you. This is only the beginning. Your trials and tribulations is to get you to the next level in your life. It's not about the storm. It's about how you go through the storm and how you come out. And just know that the sun... Look at it. Well, shine. If you hold out the S O N and the S U N, well, shine on your life. God has a purpose and a plan for you, for me, for us all. Whole world in His hand. Love on one another. Be a blessing to somebody else. And have a great Tuesday. Okay? And remember, Mama Q loves you. Bye-bye.